Stephen Simmons was like any other 24 year old. He absolutely loved and lived for sport. He played rugby for the Leinster team. He was always out with his friends. He loved going out for his few pints. He was always busy, always on the go. He worked seven days a week. He worked five days in the glass factory. And then at the weekends, he worked as a security guard in music festivals all over. One weekend, he was a security guard for the All Together Now Festival in Waterford. When he was making his way home, he was involved in a car crash, which changed everything. He was then sent to the Matter Hospital in Dublin, which in his words, saved his life. Never indoors, always outdoors. Mm -hmm. Loved life, loved me few pints. They basically saved my life. They said anyone else, that, uh, only I was so big, he said anyone else would be in Killstone's head in the car crash. So I was very lucky that day. No one knew what way I'd come out after. So, thank God I'm here. Following his 12 hour life saving surgery, Stephen was incredibly grateful to the Matter Hospital. Following this, he went to the Claren Bridge care home where he currently resides today, having the crack with the staff watching Netflix and of course enjoying the gym five days a week. Previous to lockdown, Stephen's friends and family visited him nearly every day. But unfortunately, due to the restrictions, they haven't been able to lately, so he communicates with them through Zoom and Facebook and other social media. But Stephen has used his time in lockdown for good, inspiring others, spreading positivity, and raising money for the Matter Hospital, which saved his life by doing 100 miles in August. And we're very pleased to say that Stephen reached his goal. You have to have something to keep your mind occupied. You can't, you can, I try to be as positive as I can, but it's just, if I didn't have a gym or, I just, well, what would you do like? You're just sitting in your room all day like, I'm grateful for the gym, really grateful. Before the lockdown, Stephen was interviewed by Brian Tuberty on the RT Radio 1 show. His story was a source of inspiration to listeners who were quick to call in and congratulate Stephen on his positivity and his determination to lead a normal life again. His friends and family have set up a GoFundMe page. One of the things that Stephen accredits his impressive positive attitude to is his incredible support network. Stephen was sure to tell us about his amazing family and friends and how they've supported him before and after this accident and don't treat him like a different person. Stephen's also made loads of new friends because of his experience. People who can relate to him and have had similar experiences themselves. Stephen also wanted to express his gratitude to the Matter Hospital and to everyone at his care home. How he gets on with the staff, he's able to joke with them. It really brightens up his day so much. I get on really well with them, I think it's just because mm. I'm, I'm the same age, so... Now they're a lot mature than I, I'm immature, they're mature. <laughs> yeah, I remember during the interview when we first met Stephen, I actually asked him if anybody was going through a tough time or if he had a message like for people like who went through a similar experience to him or different he actually told us a saying that he learned in school which really really stayed with me after the interview um it was a day without a smile is a day wasted I would think because I'm so strong, strong-minded and a good family. That's why I'm so positive. I, I don't care I'll never walk in, it doesn't bother me. As, the way I look at it, I've spent 20 years walking. I have enough walking done now. The day I found out I wouldn't walk, I took that on the chin. The roar of the crowds when running on the pitch. Side by side with the lads, I've never felt as rich. Blue and white surrounding us are beck and call. Overwhelming pride from those big and small. I'm blessed in this life with my family and friends. 
tires outside, whiskey and music forever transcends. Gazing at the stars while the final ambers burn. I smile to hear the singing crickets return. Tribes of all over gather to escape and connect. In fields abundant in magical tunes and respect. It ended as we celebrated into the night. Sharing stories, hopes and dreams until first light. Chaos reveals mortality, forever changing my reality. Kind minds and kind hands work under a body's demands. An old life ends, a new one begins. Still, never a day without grins. Along the path, I meet a friend with a helping hand to extend. And another follows suit. They'll follow my new route. My cheer remains resilient. I increase my fulfillment. By training hard and letting down my guard, I build on my new path with love and not wrath. The beauty of life remains the same, even on this unexplored terrain. Still the same person before you, just enjoying a different view. And I used to always say, I said, a day without a smile is a day wasted. <laughs>